Mobius boys think there's another artifact in a world called Monlith. Supposedly, there's Protoss guarding it. A group of fanatics call themselves the Taldarim. Now, don't get all sentimental thinking these Taldarim are your old Protoss buddies, because they ain't. There it is, Jimmy. Just like Mobius said. Easy money. I don't know. There's a lot of Protoss down there. We're gonna have to... What the? Warning. Multiple Zerg biosignatures detected. Ah, hell. Them critters were just hiding underground, waiting? No idea, but you can bet they're headed straight for our shrine. Well, that show complicates things. We can't fight two armies at once, partner. With any luck, we won't have to. We only need to hold the area at the top of the shrine long enough to extract the artifact. So we'll land here and cut our way through the Protoss lines while they're busy with the Zerg. It's only a matter of time before the Zerg overwhelm the Protoss. We'd best grab the artifact and be long gone by then. minerals. The Zerg severely outnumber the Protoss forces. It is likely the Protoss will fall shortly. Well, here's the plan. Then we've got to get that artifact before the Zerg overrun the whole place. Stalkers are gathering at our perimeter. Incoming transmission. I got something new for you, cowboy. Marauders, the latest word in Big Bada Boom hardware. I ain't sure this is the best time to be experimenting, Swan. Best time there is. Let the Marauders loose against those stalkers, and you'll see. Been waiting on you. Outstanding. That's fine. Affirmative. Thank you. 
your shirt out of spite. Sure thing. Armed and ready. Warning, incoming Zerg attack wave detected. Insufficient Vespine gas. In the rear. This bit. Who wants some? It's about to get heavy. Got it. Orders received. SCV ready. Additional supply depots required. SCV ready. Is under attack. Ten four. Roger that. Go, go, go! Who won? Oh, it's a I'm in a world of hurt. Go on. You gonna give me orders? Go ahead. Well 
will do. Gangway, coming through. Man, this better be good. good here. Yeah, whatever. Armed and ready. Where does it hurt? Upgrade complete. By the numbers, boys. Not enough minerals. This better be good. You rang? Who wants some? Standing by. Armed and ready. You rang? Must be an emergency. By the numbers, boys. Huh? It's about to get heavy. Yeah. Got a whole lot of love. It's go time. By the numbers, boys. Go, go, go! Who wants some? Aye, aye, sir. Sure thing. It's about to get heavy. enough minerals. Big job! What's going on? Gangway, coming through. Roger that. Just say when. This better be good. Arm, it's about to get heavy! Got it. That's fine. Ten more.
You got it. Affirmative. Crew coming down to pick up the artifact. We got what we came for. Let's hightail it out of here. I forgot how resourceful you were, Jim. I won't make that mistake twice. Kerrigan. Funny convict. I don't recall giving you access to our database. Just keeping up on current events, Captain. Seems this Queen of Blades got everybody running scared. <laughs> she don't look so tough. You have no idea who she is, do you, Tychus? Don't matter to me, none. Well, it matters to Jim. They were close once. Wait a minute. <laughs> You're telling me they were shacked up? Apparently she was something else. Before the Zerg took her. Turned her into that. And Jimmy feels responsible. Honestly, if we have to face her again, I don't know what he'll do. Woman like that, there's only one thing to do.
I caught Tychus hacking into our database, sniffing around about Kerrigan. I don't know what his game is, but we clearly can't trust him. Matt, me and Tychus ran together a long time. Got in all sorts of trouble. When the law finally caught up, he took the rap for both of us. Never once ratted me out. I got a second chance. He got locked up. I understand your loyalty, sir, but... I owe him, Matt. Leave it be. Yes, sir. I should really take this down. Guess the crew thinks it's cool or something. Your Mobius buddies ever happen to mention that the Queen of Blades wants these artifacts too? Hey, they just give me the missions, man. What's it matter anyway? Putting that bitch down would be doing everyone a favor. I thought it was just about the money with you, Tychus. Nothing says I can't do my part for humanity and get paid well for my trouble. Right. This is Donnie Vermillion live from UNN. Tonight, we're going to discuss the infamous Queen of Blades. Scientists and military insiders have long speculated that the enigmatic alien is, in fact, an infested human. That's right, Donnie. Is it possible that the leader of the Zerg has a human heart? More importantly, Kate, could this mean some kind of Terran-Zerg alliance is possible? Donnie, there's never been any evidence at all to suggest that infested humans retain their free will. You make a good point, Kate. The question is, then, how do we kill her? That's one I think we all can agree on. If humanity is to survive, the Queen of Blades needs to be eliminated. Commander. The alien artifact is all secure in the lab, sir. You know, seeing it got me to thinking about my special projects. Whoa, slow down, Stedman. What do you mean, projects? You doing some kind of research down here? Yeah, well, you know, not yet, sir. I still need some additional specimens to get things going. Once I get those, we can make some big improvements to our weapon systems and tactics. Well, I'm all for that. What do you need? All kinds of things. I've entered the details into our database. If you run into something on a mission that we need, you'll be notified automatically. Just try not to blow up the ship, okay, Stedman? I've been hearing strange stories from the crew of late. Unexplained noises, strange visions, voices in the dark. Rumor has it these things are haunted. Superstitious nonsense. These artifacts are completely inert and they're contained down here in the lab. There is some trace radiation, but I don't see how they could affect things elsewhere on the ship. Heaven forbid we run across alien tech that messes with our primitive little monkey brains. Just keep a close eye on them, Doc. That Zerg woman seemed to know you. She really rattled you, didn't she? Me and her, well, we go back a ways. She was a ghost once. Back then, we were hooked up with Manx and fighting to get rid of the old Confederacy. <laughs> we made a pretty good team. What happened to her? She was a casualty of war. No offense, Doc. But I really don't like to talk about it. I understand. If you ever change your mind, I'm here.
right, sir? Confronting Kerrigan again after all these years. We've got to stop her, Matt. No matter what she's after. Well, we gave her a setback today. The artifacts are obviously important to her. I just wish we knew why. <laughs>